Hi Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Capricorn with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see what's going on for you this week, Capricorn. All right, so first card out, the Ten of Wands, okay? Um, very taxing relationship. Could feel like a scapegoat, like everything is on you, burdensome, drudgery. You know, uh, just carrying the load here, doing everything in a relationship, feeling like you just don't know where this is going, but you just keep showing up for it, whatever it may be. This could also be cracking under the weight of your own success. You got so much going on. You're very successful in doing whatever it is you do that is just burdensome at this point, you know. This is also just being on autopilot, just showing up, you know. Uh, let's see what's going on here. What is the advice for Capricorn this week? What's the advice for Capricorn? This could be a karmic connection also. Uh, yeah, the judgment in the five of wands. So it's like you have to make a decision about maybe a, a third party or about um, who you want to give your energy effort time to. Do you want to still be so, you know, risky or frisky or um, all over the place? Or do you really want, you know, a solid relationship? You have to determine what it is you really want. Um, the universe is asking you to make some fast judgment, you know, because things are happening um, very quickly for you. Make some fast decision. All right, let's see what the outcome is. Yeah, the Ace of Pentacles is because there's going to be opportunity presented to you. And if you don't see that opportunity, the card said, look again, an opportunity maybe even for love, devotion. I heard opportunity for implantation. So maybe you're trying to get pregnant. Opportunity to grow something. Maybe the relationship, uh, a business. This is opportunity getting creative about how to make money and what to do. Um, you have to determine. Some of you do some real hard, tough labor, work, or laborious work here. You have to determine. Um, some of you, this could be even be sexuality, holding on or hanging on to the secret of maybe, you know, liking the same sex here. You have to determine if that's what you want to do, if that's what you want to go after. Um, if, if that's what you you long for. Maybe coming out of the closet here with the sun card. You've come to some self-analysis that you, this is the life you want. You want to engage in relationship, but you don't want to be in anything committed for some of you. There's an energy of, you know, just wanting to be in some love affair. There's somebody you're dealing with who likes the same sex also. Could be you. Could be someone else. Let's see what the cards have to say. What do the angel answers have to say for Capricorn? So there's a connection where there's a lot of doing. Yeah, you need to take action. Um, because the cards said there's no need to worry. But you need to take action about Whatever it is you're doing. If you want to come out of the closet. If you want to, you know, um, be honest about your sexuality. Whoa. Say yes with an exclamation point. Yes. Definitely do it. We do clarify our yes answers here at the channel. Let's see what this yes answer is. You have a definite yes. Some of you, if you just really want to just put yourself out there. It says yes. Queen of Cups. You know, self-development. You know, uh, listen to your intuition. You are a gift to the universe, to the world. You have something to offer. You have many layers to your personality. Some of you, this could even be accepting the fact that your person does like the opposite, the same sex, and you're okay with that. Can't make it up. Queen of Wands coming out. Yeah, just accepting it. You know, maybe it was challenging news or conflicting news in the beginning, but now you come to some resolution, some resolve here. This is what I have for you. If it resonates for you, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Go over to the website and book your own reading there. Ask a question or two um, by texting your question to the number below. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You can also um, join the channel by clicking the Join button where you will get access to the extended readings and then you will also um, be able to ask a question of me each and every month okay thank you many blessings to you take care